Welcome to Best of the Locker Room, and we'll start with Aaron Rodgers on the rookie receivers, a story that's probably not going away anytime soon. The jump happens when you don't become a robot anymore. You understand the why and the what. Why are we doing what we're doing and what are we trying to accomplish? It takes a while for anybody. There's been a few guys who've kind of used training camp and the OTAs and have been maybe a little ahead in the beginning. There's some guys that haven't gotten most of the first year. So we'll see where they fall, but you got to be patient. They're talented guys. Um, you know, we just got to keep giving them opportunities. And when they get the chance to make plays, they got to make the plays. Good news. Alan Lazard has returned to practice. And when it comes to connecting with Aaron Rodgers and being a productive piece in the Packers' offensive puzzle, Allen has been there and done it. A lot of it's just confidence in yourself and just being deliberate in your routes and decision making. Um, that way, he's able to read off of you. You know, I think it's when you're playing slow, playing hesitant, is when he feels the indecisiveness, and that's when it kind of gets off the read and everything. So just to believe in the coaching, the trusting, honing in on your playbook, and just focusing on the details will just help everything kind of marry up a little bit better. The Packers have never lost two straight games during a regular season under Matt LaFleur. One of the reasons, leaders like Mercedes Lewis. The NFL, I mean, the, the margin for error is, is slim, right? And so, you know, when you go through games like that or situations like that, you got to be able to come back with the same energy you went into that week. For us, our, our locker room is super close from top to bottom. I'm not worried about us. Um, we'll be fine. 